wanted to design something and build something which is contextual, something which fits very well into the Blackburn area and the environs, the natural surroundings, the trees and the lake. Something that was made warm and homely. So the idea of the entrance is to give you that openness so that you, you weren't in walking into a small enclosed room, you walked into a room, you had visual connection with the lounge room, visual connection with the little courtyard which we created just behind the study. You wanted the visual connection so that you walk through the front room and you look right to the backyard so you felt like this is my whole site, I'm working with the whole site rather than just working with an entrance. The formal lounge room contains a lovely fireplace with a lovely walkway entrance. So once you're in, this, in that lounge room, sit nicely, warmly inside, a glass of wine, a cup of coffee maybe, Saturday afternoon, just enjoy the surroundings. The idea of the kitchen was to create a central block as you walk into this main room. It is quite a large space. So we wanted to divide the space um, with some small hints of the drop in the ceiling and then also with the colour of the kitchen with this large central island bench, somewhere where you can gather as a family and have that central clean wall behind you so that you didn't have a mess behind you as well as in front of you. Then you open the middle doors and the pantry, which everyone loves a pantry these days. Um, it was at the back, but it's still part of the main kitchen. It's, it's another dimension to that whole room so that your kitchen is much bigger than you really think it is. So the idea of having a bedroom downstairs is just for variety and also um, flexibility in spaces. I always like to design my spaces which are a little bit flexible and also accommodating for different types of users, whether you have the elderly, whether you have a family or whether you have just a couple on their own. That way you have the option of sleeping downstairs um, or moving yourself upstairs. There are three bedrooms upstairs which will give you lots of opportunities for either family or yourself and you will also have the opportunity of having an elderly couple living here they don't have to manoeuvre up and down the stairs daily on a daily basis. The focus that I have on my, on my designs is to have natural light. Um, nothing worse than coming home and having to switch on the lights for every, every minute of the day. Any good family home needs somewhere where you need to entertain, somewhere you need to sit and enjoy the sunlight. So we purposely designed a courtyard around the living area. So we wanted to have a space that you could actually sit, enjoy the afternoon sun, enjoy the day, barbecue if you have to, glass of wine, glass of beer in the afternoon and sit there and just enjoy your backyard and watch on and see what's happening around you. You can also from there sit back inside, see what's happening. There's a real connection between the two spaces. I think the, the finishes and the textures externally are quite natural quite warm um, and they sort of fit well with, with the tree surrounding. So I think it's just the overall forms, all the shapes and forms that I don't do really like about this whole problem. The uh, Blackburn area is, is a wonderful space because of the lake. It's a, it's a beautiful lake, lovely surroundings to it, lovely walks and lovely gardens through there. So that we've purposely designed a family home that you can take your family of two, three or four children and essentially wander down to the lake area, enjoy your picnic in the afternoon, go for a run if you like, if that's so inclined, and then come back to your lovely home, sit back, relax, and just enjoy the surroundings. So that was the concept of, of providing a family home, which is a working family home, but also quite a comfortable family home with that surrounding area of the lake.